Nuclear medicine involves the use of radioactive drugs for diagnostic and therapeutic purposes. This short film is focused on the therapy part. The nuclear medicine department is specialized in examinations and treatments using radioactive isotopes. At the department, medical physicists work together with radiologists and radiology nurses. As physicists, it's our job to prepare and handle the radioactivity that will be administered to the patients. The amount of radioactivity varies from one patient to another, and we are responsible for adapting the treatment so that the correct radiation dose is given to each patient. We meet with the patient to give information about the treatment and administer the radioactive drug. The patient is usually asked to drink a radioactive liquid or swallow a radioactive pill. After the treatment, the patient is radioactive. Depending on the radiation levels, the patient has to keep a distance to the members of their family for a period of time after the treatment. To minimize the exposure to ourselves, we work behind lead screens which block most of the radiation. In order to avoid exposure to children or pregnant women, the patients sometimes have to be admitted to the hospital. We calculate for how long the patient has to stay at the hospital and how they can spend time with their family after going home again. After the treatment, a series of images of the patient are acquired using detectors that show the distribution of radioactivity in the body. Based on these images, we physicists calculate the radiation dose to the patient resulting from the treatment. Our treatments are targeted, and as physicists, we are crucial to the success of the treatment and the cure of the patient.